Hi everyone, it's Karen from the Graphics Fairy here, and I thought it would be fun to do just a little haul video showing you some of the antique books and paper ephemera items that I got in this week, sort of a little preview of what's to come. Uh, so the first one I'm going to show you is this very cool, very old garden book that I got in from London this week. And look at how old this one is. It's pretty old. I want to say maybe 1870s or something, mid 1800s. Anyway, it's full of these gorgeous leaf graphics. This one fell out. <laughs> um, this one almost looks like a feather. I think it's really, really pretty. But the whole book is full of, it's just leaves, just like that. And so a lot of them are tropical type house plants like this one. And I wish you guys could feel how they feel. The ink is, it almost feels like it's hand painted on there. It's sort of laying on top of the paper. There's also some really cool little engravings too. Hopefully you can see that. With each leaf, I think there's a, uh, an engraving. And this one's really pretty. And I want to say there's maybe 40 of them in here. There's a lot. I'm not going to show them all to you because that would take too long. But I thought they would be fun to frame and hang together like in a collection. Here's another really pretty one. Lots of stripes on that one. So anyway, that's that one. And I also got this cute children's book, Henny Penny, which there's not much inside, but I just loved the covers, the front and the back cover. Just thought those were really cute. Fun to do some sort of little farmhouse project, maybe cute in like a farmhouse kitchen or something like that. And then I got this French type book in. It's got some sort of plastic cover on it. I'm not sure why, but I think this one's from around the 1880s. And this is a book I've been after for a while, so I was pretty excited to get this one. But it's got, hopefully you can see that. There's some sort of handwritten looking French letters in it. And this you might recognize. I have a couple of these on my blog now. Last summer I went to the Library of Congress and made a copy of this page, but now I have the whole book. Yay! Those are pretty cool. They're all banners, all different shapes and sizes. And it's got some gorgeous monograms in it. Those are fun. All kinds of little doodads. Um, a lot of these let's see, sort of big, bold typography looking things that could make some, some kind of fun signs or something. There's some more. These are sort of fancier looking letters. Pretty cool. So that's that one. And then I got some little postcards. I got this little, um, I don't know, I thought that would be cute for Valentine's. It's like violets inside of a box. So I'll be posting that one soon. And I got a bunch of um, die cut scrap pieces, Victorian pieces. So these are fun because they're already cut out in the shape and everything. So I got these little dogs. And then I got in these little lady scraps, Victorian ladies. What I like about these is uh, these ones with the where they have their arms and everything. A lot of my readers make them into little paper dolls just by adding little uh, skirts out of tissue paper, and that's just a cute little fun little project to do. And then the last one, um, which I love, is this adorable little French teacup, and it has all these little roses on it. Really, really cute. It's an old French advertisement. So I'll be 
scanning that and or all of these I'm posting them soon to share with you guys so I hope you enjoy this little sneak peek of what's to come and I hope you'll come visit me over on my blog at thegraphicsfairy.com you can grab all of the graphics that I have over there for free and use them in your projects all right thanks bye